Any other awards yeah. show, highlights music that people might not necessarily <laughs> listen to. I think somebody must have heard my rehearsal because that's really Well, the thing is, classical is like, you know, you can say the word country, it means so much now. Classical's got so much crossover happening. You know, it's getting radio play and it's on mainstream. So it's, you know, it's, especially for what we do and where we come from, it's given us a, an access towards, you know, you know, contemporary music stuff. So it's great to see classical kind of like bridge two gaps. Yeah. It's nice to be at a night celebrating classical music, honestly, because there's so many award shows for all the different types of genres of music, but I think for classical music to get its own special evening here at this beautiful Royal Albert Hall is, is really special. Mm. Well, I think it's, again, it, it puts them on a map, it gives people access to the music that might have not heard before, and, you know, maybe, especially like, I, I would think true classical artists aren't necessarily looking for that crossover, you know, they've got their own audience, their own, but I think to get recognition for the hard work and the, the music they produce, I think it's a great thing, you know. Yeah, just being able to be honoured for the type of music that they are producing and um, I just think, yeah, awards are awesome. But how cool is it for us to be here tonight, right? So yeah. One year ago we did Phantom to this day, so it's a bit of an anniversary for us as well. I mean, also, oh, it's incredible, the and it, 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 it's enjoy your performance so, so you're out there with them more, aren't you? Also brings Have you been rehearsing? Uh, we sort of stage to the mainstream as well. How interesting is TV sort of taking it to the matches? Well, you know, I, it's funny you bring that up because I got different views about it, but at the same time, what's good about it is it's, it's, it's inspiring. Like I see on Twitter, people follow me. They've, a lot of kids are now getting inspired by it. So if it inspires and it gets kids into the arts and it's uh, bringing masses to the theaters, then that's, you know, you look at those positives and that's a good thing. Is there a flip side? Is there, is there a, 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 perhaps a flip side for you as well, the way that you think about it in the sense that, you know, if you say you've been trained for years and years and years and then it's a competition for people who necessarily haven't had that level of dedication. Well, what's stopping those guys going for it? Like, I don't think I could ever go for it because there's also an element of moxie that you need. Like, I think I'd, I'd burn under the pressure. So, you know, hats off to anyone who goes for it. I don't think I could do it. <laughs> awesome. Thank you very much, guys. Thank you. Thank you.